To Hong Kong, uh, police have once again appealed to remaining protesters in Polytechnic University to surrender their weapons and leave the campus peacefully. The standoff has now gone on for four days. At the same time, primary and secondary schools have reopened almost a week after classes were suspended over the safety and transportation concerns. But it hasn't been all smooth sailing. Protests have become something of a lunchtime fixture in Hong Kong, and today was no different. Hundreds showed up for demonstrations in three districts, bringing traffic to a standstill in at least one. Some chaotic scenes in the morning as well. Commuters were faced with transport disruptions as they tried to make their way to work. Train operator MTR said protesters opened rear emergency doors on several trains. Six MTR lines were plagued by delays and closures. There was also friction in the Kwantung area, where residents squabbled with high school students, marking their return by blocking traffic. Meanwhile, cleanup began outside Polytechnic University, where the police siege stretched into its fourth day. Police have arrested over a thousand people since the standoff began.